Hello, hello, and welcome to my channel. My name is Kat. I am the Nurse Flipper. If this is your first time here, welcome. Today is a great day because it's like eBay turn the flip, turn the flip, turn the switch back on. We all of a sudden on Friday and Saturday had a lot of sales. So all of a sudden the sales were going crazy Friday, Saturday. Then yesterday, almost crickets again. Today, it is good as well. So we have almost $1,400 going out on eBay. Plus, we have sales on all of the other platforms as well. So I'm excited to show you there are a lot of higher dollar and fast selling items in this video. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so the first sale is actually a pretty big one. It came in this morning. I paid up for this item. I paid $40. If you do not know, this is a little Zuni fetish carved lizard. It is carved out of a gorgeous piece of turquoise. And if I tilt it just there on the light, you can see this one is signed on all four feet as well as the bottom. I was not able to identify. That looks like a little leaf up there but i paid 40 dollars for this little lizard and he sold on a best offer this morning of 175 dollars watch for zuni carved animals especially out of really nice stone they can be worth hundreds so i paid 40 this one is going to be about a hundred dollar profit and it sold in under a month so i don't take a ton of time trying to identify that signature I still got $175. Could it have been worth more if I identified the artist? Possibly, but sometimes you're just not able to. So I did put artist signed. I did take good photographs and that was an amazing sale. Up next, it is football season. I love football, both NFL and college and you need to get your football stuff listed if it is not this could go to any football fan this is a football wine stopper it is well dressed home this one sold for $12.99 plus the buyer paid shipping i only paid a dollar so this one is going to be about a nine dollar profit up next is another jewelry piece this is a gorgeous potoski stone out of Michigan. These are really, really neat stones. I actually sold a bracelet last week for over 150 of this stone. This one sold for $46.79 plus the buyer paid shipping. I am only about $10 in. So this one is about a $28 profit and it sold in under a month. It does have a sterling silver chain as well. Up next is a purse. This is a gorgeous beaded purse. Look at the fringe on this. And it has no top, guys. Needs repair or restoration, but beautiful pattern. I paid 10 for this. It sold for $40, making it about a $25 profit. And this one sold in about three months. Up next is a little really pretty jade necklace. This one's been listed over a year. I got it in a jewelry lot. I'm about $5 in. It sold for $9.09. So it's only about a $2 or $3 profit, but I am happy to have it go. I think one of the deterrents for this one selling is my pictures were not all that great. They were pretty dark with the jewelry back then. So I think if I had had better pictures, I might have sold it faster and for a higher price. Up next is some ephemera. I haven't bought any ephemera in a while because it is quite long tail and it sells for around the $10 mark typically. Sometimes five or seven this one sold for seven but i am pennies in so it's about a five dollar profit they aren't breakable really easy to ship and list and all i do for these is take a picture of the front and the back i don't do any interior pages just because of the lower value i don't want to spend a ton of time on them this one took about two and a half years to sell and it is about a five dollar profit up next i think i sold some other shark parts last what sold video this is a shark steamer attachment 
This one sold for $4.54 plus the buyer paid shipping. It's about a $3 profit. I intended on selling the whole vacuum which was a decent profit but it was returned they said it wasn't working properly so i parted it out just to try and get a little money back but this thing took about two years to sell up next is a beautiful very heavy summer so vase you can see look at how thick this glass is on the bottom beautiful polished bottom this one took two and a half years to sell it sold for 45.49 i paid 10 so it's about a 28 dollar profit elizabeth arden kitty cat i will show you the top of her really really pretty this is a little candle you can see it says bluegrass by elizabeth arden this one i picked up for a dollar it sold for 12.98 so it's about a nine dollar profit but this one took about a year and a half to sell up next is a hat and i have just listed a ton of vintage hats my niece has been photographing and putting them into the drafts for me so we are getting more listings up which could be what resulted in the switch being turned back on so she listed about 75 last week for me i got them all up throughout the week this is a vintage judds rockin with the rhythm this hat sold in under a week for 17 dollars I paid a dollar. This one is in excellent condition and this one's going to be about a $14 profit. Up next is the biggest sale of the week and it is a bolo tie. If you have not watched my bolo tie video, I have a high dollar only bolo tie research video. Look at this gorgeous Kachina dancer. This one is marked sterling you can see there and it is also signed by the artist and this bolo tie i accepted a best offer of 389 dollars i paid 50 for this so this one is actually close to a 300 dollars profit but it did take close to two years to sell so some of these higher dollar items it does take a while to get the right buyer but this one was a great sale and there are quite a few bolo ties that are worth a lot of money so keep your eye out for those up next is a coffee mug that took like three years to sell this one miss deb rescued out of my store so miss deb thank you so much miss deb picked this one up for five dollars i've had it for like three years there is the bottom so you live and learn you get better the longer you're reselling and learn more so i picked it up for a dollar it's about a three dollar profit and miss deb thank you so so much for rescuing that coffee mug another coffee mug rescue by miss deb look at how gorgeous though this is one of my favorite coffee mugs i have ever found it's got the dragonfly the duck with the worm mama and baby this gorgeous tanala cup miss deb picked up for 14 dollars. i've had this one over a year as well i did pay i believe three for this one so i paid up a little bit and this one's going to be about an eight dollar profit up next is a wire chicken this i think most people put eggs or maybe onions in it so little you can see me now um this little wire chicken sold for 17 dollars. i picked it up in a big kitchen lot i am less than a dollar in so it's about a 14 dollar profit it did take about a year and a half to sell all right the holidays are coming along with football season and fall so we sold this garden flag this one it reminds me kind of holiday-ish sold for seven i picked it up for a dollar so this one's going to be about a five dollar profit took about six months to sell and this one is brand new in the package all right some more stuff going out to miss deb and another rescue i've had this over a year i was super surprised this one is a signed tanala piece absolutely gorgeous gravy boat and miss deb picked this one up for 12. i actually paid five so this little gravy boat's only going to be about a three dollar profit so again stuff i picked up a few years ago is definitely not stuff i would pick up now not all of it anyways you kind of have to learn as you go and one of the crazy things is that 
some things might sell well for one person but they don't for another and there's like no way to explain why like some people do excellent with ties i can't save them to sell or sell them to save my life i do very well with handkerchiefs some people have wrote me and said they don't so you got to figure out what works for you and you will do that with time the longer and longer you resell up next is a t-shirt this is a corona shirt i put pinup girl corona watch for graphics graphics sell shirts i picked this up for three dollars at my little local thrift store this one took six months to sell and it sold for 20 and it is going to be about a 12 dollar profit i do want to show you because i have them sitting right here so like with that shirt and other non-breakable items these are my new favorite these are giaro packs super cute daisies i've been giving these away on my tuesday night live podcast but i will put the link down below because giaro pack is giving everybody 10 percent off with code the nurse flipper so these as well as their padded poly mailers we use over a thousand a month shipping out whatnot check out giaro pack they're good quality the shipping is fast and you get 10 percent off using the nurse flipper discount code and don't forget to my go-to tape another great supply that is from american bubble boy who we get our bubble wrap from but joel is giving everybody five percent off all tape with same code the nurse flipper so if you need shipping supplies check out giaro pack for those poly mailers and american bubble boy for your tape as well as bubble wrap up next is another shirt this is a lady shirt really cute little polka dot this one is a Talbot. I love picking up Talbots. They don't sell for a ton. This one sold for nine, but I got it for 50 cents. So it's about a $7 profit, but it did take over a year to sell. All right, we have got some more jewelry. And one of the ways I'm kind of attempting to direct my business is to do more jewelry, higher dollar, make more money, sell less items, right? More money, less work. That is what all of us want. So this is a gorgeous signed Christian Dior. Not sure if you'll be able to see it. It does say Dior there in the back. This one I got in a jewelry lot. I paid less than $5 and this one sold for $80 plus the buyer paid shipping. So this one is about a $65 profit. Up next is another item that took over two years to sell, but it is so cute. It is a Costa Rica hoodie nothing on the back it is plain i picked this up for only a dollar at a garage sale this one sold for 15 took over a year but it is about a 12 dollar profit up next is another hat that sold really fast this is a camo philadelphia eagles hat this one is a strap back it does say eagles back there this one has been listed less than a week. I paid a dollar. It sold for $9.50. So it is about a $7 profit. All right, some more stuff I wouldn't pick up again. This is Guardian Aluminum Wear. This pitcher sold for a whole $10. It's not breakable though, which is a nice thing. Um, but it took over a year to sell. I'm actually only a couple dollars in. So it's going to be about a $5 profit. I don't need it up next is two items the buyer picked up totaling 21 this really cute delft holland handmade little holder i guess it could be a little pot and then they also got this royal nippon little bowl this one is also signed so these two i only paid a dollar each the together they sold for 21 and they are going to be about a 14 dollar profit up next is a really good book sale though it took about two years this is an edgar Allan poe book this one sold for 25.98 i only paid a dollar it did take a long time to sell but super easy to list and ship and it's going to be about a 20 dollar profit up next is a really cool lighthouse frame this one is from coco k in the bahamas this is glass 
really really pretty stained glass with the seagulls and the lighthouse this one i picked up at the thrift store for three dollars it sold for 16 so it's going to be about a ten dollar profit it did take over a year to sell up next is a medline scrub this is a 3x this one sold for a whole four dollars but i had it thrown in my closet i think i got this and was wearing it when i was pregnant this one is about a three dollar profit but it actually sold in only two months so some of the plain scrubs i typically am not going to pick up i only listed this one because i already had it in my closet all right that is everything for ebay we are going to show you the other platforms if your sales are low or you want to have more sales i would definitely think about cross posting we do use list perfectly and you can get 30 percent off using code the nurse flipper so go check it out try it for a month and see you should see pretty immediate results on sales from the other platforms we cross post to etsy mercari and poshmark etsy by far is the most work of those cross posting so if you're just starting out i would try maybe poshmark or mercari unless you're selling a lot of rare vintage then etsy might be the best place to go so i am going to show you what sold over on etsy posh and mercari so on etsy we only had one sale it is this beautiful vintage coral and turquoise sterling silver ring this one is signed bbj i got this in an online auction lot i paid 10 this one sold for 70 on etsy in under a month and it is going to be about a 50 dollar profit up next on poshmark is this tiger woods this is a golf polo pick this one up for three dollars and this one sold on posh for 25 dollars it has only been a few months my payout is 17 so this one is about a 13 dollar profit and then this cute little apron look at this gingham apron it has got the little ruffled pockets this one sold over on Mercari for $16. I paid a dollar. My payout is 13. So this is about a $12 profit. It did take a little over six months to sell. This game took three years, three years to sell. Herd your horses. I got it in a big game lot. I listed it, it's been listed for three years. Sold for $9 on Mercari. And I only paid a dollar. It's gonna be about a $7 profit this buyer actually wrote me and asked if i would sell only the cards i couldn't sell the whole game for nine dollars so i told him i would discount the shipping and only send the cards but i wasn't coming down on the price so they actually decided to just get the whole game they needed it for replacement parts and i am glad to see it go up next these sold pretty fast they actually sold an under ah I, I keep flipping them um these actually sold in under a month they are vintage napkins in the case pick them up for a dollar and these sold for 15 on poshmark payout is 12 so they are about 11 dollar profit and like with these i didn't take them out of the sealed package i don't know the size i just know it said they are napkins and i didn't want to unseal it because it's vintage and typically with a vintage if it's sealed it is worth a little bit more last is a scrub top this one sold over on mercari for nine dollars i paid three this one's going to be about a four dollar profit and it sold in about two months all right that is everything i appreciate you watching i hope your ebay sales are picking up as well just know some people are doing great on ebay right now and when we're doing great sometimes people are not so it really depends on what you're selling it is not completely site-wide i have seen both people having a hard time getting sales as well as people doing really really good so take a look at what you're selling make sure you check that sell through rate see how many are sold compared to listed and only pick up stuff that is selling well and then you should have better sales so i appreciate you watching i hope you have a wonderful weekend
I will be live on whatnot tonight at 8 30 p.m. Eastern as well as tomorrow so I would love it if you would come and join me I'll, I'll drop the link down below with the whatnot code as well as GRO pack and bubble boy for your shipping supplies I hope you have an excellent excellent weekend bye for now